Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Space Engineers! I'm excited. So, um, I just started the game up again and uh, I noticed a bug, so I think we're gonna have to teleport back to Earth here. Um, up profiles, teleport to Earth. I guess we're gonna always have to remember adjust those or whatever. Uh-oh. That's not good. Beep bop, beep bop, beep bop! Uh, to Earth. From. Oh, okay, never mind. To Earth. Uh. To Earth. But why does it say from? Oh, there we go. To. There, there we go. That should fix some things, hopefully. Yep, there we go. It's gonna work. Run! It's gonna get us all! You can't get us. Run! Apparently it can. There you go. That should hopefully fix that weirdness happening. I think the problem is the area has to be loaded or something, maybe. And it's inaccurate, maybe? It's just giving you, like, approximate reading? I don't know. I can be making all this up, but... Either way, it was definitely looking weird, so... Now that's fixed. Thinking maybe we should get some cameras around so we can keep an eye on the base. Nope. 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 This is not good for us at all. Um, I just noticed one big issue here. I don't know where all the rest of the batteries are, but that battery was dead over there. Um, because we didn't put it back on, right? So, battery. Wait, is this the same thing? I see batter, battery. I don't know if it automatically charges when the sun's out or not. But it doesn't look good that's all going to be depleted, so... That turret's bugged again! It's funny, just the tank just lands on me. It's an oxygen bottle, man. I can breathe for a long time. That stupid thing keeps breaking, though, every time. I don't think there's anything over here to make it break either. Like, I don't think anything here is alive, but yeah, it goes this way. What a mess we've made over here. I like it. So I wonder how this could work. Um, let's go back. I don't really have any need to be here, to be honest, right now. But um, I think it's cool that we can come back here anytime we want. And uh, I guess the big thing was to go back to and fix the thing. So uh, two space, two space, space, teleport. This might... N oh, it works. No, you can't get me. Run, Cade, run. Okay, so, oh, it's going to glitch anyways, okay. Anyways, I wanted to see if I could do this, so, Earth Station, uh, Turret, and Control. There you go. So this is one method, I thought I had a clear thing on, I guess not, but this is one method of uh, being able to see the base here. That's kind of cool. So you can still go down and look at it and look around with that. 
Um, I don't know why there's... I guess the clear camera thing only works for the camera. I thought it was all of them, but maybe uh, not for that interface. You could buy a mod if you really... Or not buy a mod. You could download a mod if you really want to, but I won't make such a big deal out of that right now. Um, I did add a mod. Um, I'm not really good at building stuff, you know. Uh, so I added this grinder mod or something, or I think it was the ability to build an entire ship, but I don't know how it works... Um, and it's something I want to do over time. I won't probably do it right away, but, uh, this is one of the pieces to it, apparently. Holy crap. It's... Oh, okay, so if you... Corner and straight. Oh, okay. So with the new system, you can go through it and select them. I wonder if there's things I've been missing this entire time that I was supposed to rotate. But anyways, yeah, so this is a new thing where uh, you could build a massive shipyard, if you can believe that. Um, I thought it would help me because I'm not really big into making ships. I'm not really good at making ships, so I thought it would be a cool thing to have uh, just in the long run. But, uh, yeah. Uh, another thing. How is our fuel doing, actually? Our fuel is oh, more than fine. Um... Refinery, on the other hand, we've been not doing much with this because some of it's just... There you go. I think what we need to do is split this up, too. There you go. No point having it take forever to do the fuel and stuff. And there's another 50k here we can just grab easily. Apparently... Oh, we're looking through the reactor terminal, so can't do it. Um... Anyways, yeah, so uh, things are going pretty good, I think, uh, overall. I think it might be time to make some sort of small mining ship, I don't know. Or the other thing is actually complete this place, which I kind of want to do anyways. Um, so there's a lot for us to do anyways. And uh, let's get rid of that GPS. Um, I guess that one here. There you go. But, uh, yeah, I was kind of going for a mining ship because it would be nice to have that and it would help us quite a bit to mine the resources that we might need over time. And I know some resources slowly, slowly, slowly uh, running low. So that was one of the ideas and thoughts and all that fun stuff. Um, if we were to make a ship, we'd probably have just a normal cockpit. We would have some drills. Probably four of them. One, two, three, four gyroscopes, maybe. Probably more, who knows? Maybe less. Um, we definitely have a remote control. One, two, three, four, five, I don't know, six? Eight reactors? I don't, I don't really know how many small reactors I'd have. That's probably too many. Uh, did I go for an antenna or did I go for the remote control? There's that. The antenna. Um, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. I don't know. A bunch of those. Probably a connector. Probably a couple connectors. We'll need them on the base. Oh, by the way. Oh, boy. This has all been here. Abort mission, abort mission, abort mission. Oh. This has been all for large ship. <laughs> well, we can use the parts anyways, but this might be a little expensive endeavor. Oh, man. Maybe I could just... Nope. Was worth a thought or idea. I need like one of those auto click programs for this. Damn. Okay, well, we can easily go to assembler now and we get all the weight of this stuff in that short period of time. Okay. Where are you? There you go. Cargo container. There you go. Let's do that again. Production. Small ship stuff. There we go. So we need one of you. Um, 
we need to get one, two, three, four drills. We need one landing gear. We need one, two, three, four gyroscopes. We need an ore detector. Uh, maybe some lights. Neat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight reactors. I'm just kind of doing a big number there. Um, gonna need uh, a connector. One, two large ion thrusters, maybe. Maybe not as crazy as we did originally there. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I don't know. We'll see how that goes. Could always do with an oxygen generator too. We'll have to see how that goes. So, um, okay, so we'll hit R, I guess, probably don't want it that big, and we're going to want to build this so it's not in our way too much, can build it up here, I guess, just so we can work with it, nice, now I don't know exactly how I'm going to do this, sometimes, uh, I mean, I've never really built it empty, I should say. Um, maybe I should this time. I don't know. I used to put a lot of blocks everywhere, but like it didn't really matter in the end. And I wonder if I was wasting my time more than anything. But um, I want to get everything somewhat connected, though. Uh, see how this is in here in the front? So I want a lot of conveyors, to be honest. Because the conveyors could help a lot. Um... It's going to take a while for it to catch up anyways. Um, what about conveyors? Let's see. Conveyor. They'd be small conveyors too, I think. Let's see. Would that fit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would fit. Tier plate, motors, construction. Tier plate, motor, and construction. Okay. Tier plate. Uh, motors. Construction. There you go. I guess this would work. And then you want to hook it up to the um, grinder, the drill. Probably shouldn't have replaced what I was using right away. Oh boy. Okay, so those are going to have to... Yeah, we're going to have to bring these out even further then. Uh... Small conveyor. There we go. And then, oh, I didn't mean that one. That is kind of cool looking. Uh, I was just thinking the. Wait, I didn't pick that, did I? Oh, you know what? Oh, that's the new rotating thing. Haha. <laughs> So actually, in a sense, you probably do want that one, because, uh, or sorry, it used probably less parts. Does it use less parts? Let's see if it really does. Um, uh, yeah, it does. I don't know how far this, like, needs to be to get on there, on the good side of things here. Looks like it'll do it right on the first one, so maybe I am wrong on that. Maybe I should just stick to the normal conveyor. Uh, anyways, let's get this on here. One, two... It looks like we only need one, to be honest, but... This can't get mounted on here, so we're gonna probably have to extend these out or something like that. I assume that's something like the problem here. Might need to go up higher, but... Oh, no, there you go, that'll work. To be honest, maybe just one drill might be in, or not one drill, but the one set might be enough. I know I usually do four, but then it usually blows itself apart in a sense. Uh, 
too much in my way now. Okay, that would be one anyways. And then if we put another set, it'd have to go up or down or whatever. It also is always in the way too, which kind of always sucks, but whatever. Those look kind of cool. Okay, what about, um, hmm, maybe I will go down actually. I have an idea now. I see that. Yeah, actually, I think we will go down. And I think this will be a good idea. So it's a good spot where we built. This idea is what I want it to be. Six here. Let's see. Needs to go one more, huh? Damn, son! It does look kind of silly though, doesn't it? Maybe we can adjust this after. I have a new design. So that's like a bad thing, by the way. Yeah, that'll work. That's the idea. So what I'm going to do for this part now is we're going to change it to the 2-1 just because it would look kind of cool maybe. Uh, 9. Uh, 9, 8, 8, 8. <laughs> there we go. Now I gotta rotate it properly. Maybe pick the right one too. There you go. So that would connect those all up correctly. Need some computers. Um, probably not that many, but whatever. There you go, that's interesting. So this gives me a, a more up advantage in a way. Kind of weird, but could work actually. There's nothing stopping it from working. Gives me that better view vantage anyways, which is kind of neat. Uh, so, um, now I need to figure out how I'm gonna put all the power and everything else on this little puppy. Um, this is really cool though looking. Hmm. So I'm going to put a cargo container on it. It would end up being a large one, I believe. Which will be big. And I'll have to go underneath it. Oh man, I didn't realize it would be so big. We could... Hmm. She could always go like this instead. Um, it would be a bit of a mess to do, but it would work. And then what we could do here is, um, damn it, do I keep replacing stupid stuff again? <laughs> there you go. Wait, I thought I picked, ah, oh, damn it, I picked container, not conveyor. Uh, conveyor. Small conveyor, there you go. What we can do here is, uh, scroll wheel here. Uh, yeah. There you go. And then a normal one in the middle here. Kind of cool looking, I guess. And then we can fit the cargo container on here, I guess. Uh, now, how does the cargo container one work? It's right in the middle, so theoretically that would hopefully fit. Just like so. One display, eh? We'll have, do I have a display in here? I can't see one, but... Uh, display, display, display. In the end, it's sometimes just easier to make the damn container again. 
Oh, there it is. Oh, what? I had a bunch of displays. Okay. That should work. I don't know for sure, but the idea is, I guess if we take a piece of ore, we'd be able to tell. Um, I know the power's not on, but I think it would still let us tell. I guess we can tell. Um, I don't know if it would work with anything else side of ore, so let's try just ore. But the idea is this should... No. But is that because of a power issue too, right? Um, I don't know. But I think it should work. Looks like it matches up. Unless of ores don't fit through the small ones, which I'm 100% sure ores do because they've always been this way like that. So, the tiny ones. This will be an interesting ship though. I'm gonna have to worry about its height, but usually it's not my height I usually worry about. It's lower down, so this could be a very nice idea. Uh, so, I guess now we want to worry about things like reactors. Uh, reactor... Oh my god, my oxygen. Okay, um... This isn't, like I said, this is supposed to be more of a lightweight, not a heavy, full of armor blocks and stuff like that, so. It's gonna be different looking, for sure. It's my latest, craziest design. It's not even what I was looking for. Oh crap. Oh, I didn't realize I picked all those up. Ah, construction components, of course. There's gotta be something in my way to fail. There you go. And then with that powered up, we'll at least be able to see that conveyor in action. Um, uranium. So, here we go. Oops. Didn't click it right, I guess. There you go. It's gonna have lots of fuel in this, that's for sure. It's gonna be a very heavy ship no matter what, but hopefully that won't make a mu much of a difference in the end. There you go. So, um, let's see. So now we should put this in, yeah, you can put them in the drills. I don't know if the drills automatically eject or if it kind of fills up and does it when it mines, but uh, either way we can do it through, so that's working. Nice. Now we need to get uh, some thruster support, things like that, for sure. Um, let's see here. Oh yeah, we need... Don't ask why I type thruster instead. Um, oh, but I do need these, so... Can't complain about that. What is going on outside? Hold on. Oh, it looks like someone's a little shitty ass... It's not a modified car, it's got even like the front modified and stuff, I guess it broke down. There's a tow truck coming here to take it away. We need to take the guy to jail. Probably was making noise if he didn't have his little vehicle broken. Okay, so, 
Let's start with regular thrusters first. Now I gotta get these in so they kinda work. I don't know how well this is gonna work, to be honest. A lot of it's gonna have to be underneath, probably. I don't know if thrusters at the front would cause damage to anything, like... That, I don't know, to be honest. I don't know if this will cause damage to these. I hope not, but I don't, like, I doubt I'm going to be that lucky on the hope not part. I'm wondering if I could put them on the front like this instead. We'll have to monitor the damage over time. Steel tubes, huh? So there was something for you guys. I need a lot more, too. There you go. Okay, and then we need like an up and down kind of, you know, of course, all that fun stuff. That'll work. And then, um, I need forward and backwards, uh, or left and right, sorry. Yeah, left and right, actually. So, um... There you go, that'll work. Actually works really well. Wh which side did I just put that on? Okay. Right here. Cool. That should work really well. That side looked weird, because it's touching, I guess. The other one is touching? Is it crooked, maybe, a bit? Oh, yeah, it's crooked, I guess. Everything just looked off to me, so I was like, did I do it right? Did I not do it right? Like, I don't know here. And then, um, I guess we'll put one... Like, we need something back here, for sure. I haven't decided how to do it. I'll probably do it underneath, to be honest. Let's go ahead and get inside, if this is possible. And I don't know what this is going to do, but I'm going to go upwards if I can. If we don't do any turns or moves, it should be just fine. There you go. There we go. So that should do that anyways. Um, now we have to figure out how to do all this crazy stuff. Um... Oh, that is ugly, in a sense. Oh yeah, the container is... Oh, I might have to fix this if I can. The container doesn't match, and it bothers me, so... Large cargo container. Uh, I didn't realize that till now. Yeah, see? It doesn't match it up. Um... But does it on all the sides, kind of, or underneath, and yeah, yeah, yeah. But would you put that there or the thing on the side? I'd probably put it right above, actually. So yeah, that should work. Yeah. Or on the back, it doesn't matter. I'll pick one or the other. But there you go. That will make it better. Cool. Now uh, we could just do the thrusters. Um, I was thinking a big thruster. I don't know though. It's a bad idea. I wonder if that'll do damage to that at all. Yeah, that does not look good for that, to be honest. Doesn't look like it'd have a healthy relationship for some reason. But I guess there's one way to try it out. So, with the gyros, wow, we move a little too fast, but that's fine. Um, there you go. 
my game just crashed. Oh god, I thought my game crashed. So it definitely speeds up decently. It doesn't slow down as much, of course. Oh, actually, we flipped it, so yeah, it did. It's like, actually, wait, it is. But the forward ones won't slow it down too, too much. Okay. So let's see what's going on here. Okay. So I gotta figure out if this is doing any... Yes, it's doing damage. Okay. I had a feeling it would. So we're gonna have to lower at least one. How about these? Did these retrieve any damage at all? It doesn't look like it. Looks like they will not touch it, so that's good. So yeah, this has to go down one. There you go. It's pretty badass now. And uh, I might actually uh, update the front ones here. Oh, these are still big ones. <laughs> uh, scroll wheel, there we go. That's pretty cool now. The more thrusters are good anyway for stabilization, I think, so. I remember that being a big thing anyways back in the day, so. I'm all for it. Very cool. This actually is a pretty uh, big, but probably decent mining ship. And then next episode, we will try to semi-automate it a bit as well. It won't work so well once you get 50 plus, but if we can automate it a bit, we should be able to at least uh, make it so it can like fly back on its own or something at the 50k mark and I can say teleport myself back or something like that. We'll see. Although you have to remember there is uh, some distant issues as well. Uh, for example, um, you can't go, uh, if I remember correctly, the ra the antenna on here only goes 5k. So you're going to have to build like a remote antenna basically. Oh look, the sun's just vanishing. It's kind of cool. Slowly climbing up if you look closely. Can we see it? Oh yeah, there it is. Slowly creepy. If you get further away, it looks glitchier. If you really, really were to look, but it's not bad. Because that's the, the performance. But uh, either way, uh, yeah, I can't wait to update this more and do some more work on it. Thank you guys and girls so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time.